Hello friends, in today's video, I am going to do an unboxing of these journaling and crafting supplies that I got from Amazon. Hi, my name is Belinda. I'm the founder of Organize and Bless Mom, and I'm back with another creative idea. If you're new here, please subscribe and turn on the notifications so you will know when a new video is posted. Well, I got some new supplies that I wanted to just integrate into my crafting uh, and journaling room. Uh, I have been wanting to organize a couple of my supplies and I kind of started to see some of these things on Amazon and I went ahead and got them. So I'm gonna start with uh, these two things that are not that crafty but very important for me when doing uh, memory keeping, which is this Easy Runner Grand. I love this guy. I did get two. Um, these go inside this big Easy Runner Grand. Um, this is just a big um, tape runner and it's amazing for putting, you know, any kind of these glue uh, strips on pictures. Mostly I use it for pictures or ephemera that I'm trying to put uh, down. So I like to just buy two at a time because I go through a, a package uh, pretty quickly. The other thing that I'm very excited about is these pouches because I wanted to organize my colored pencils. So one of the activities that I like to do is to color, but I kind of have all my coloring stuff in a box and it's just not that easy to color when everything's in a box. So I'm going to organize that with you. And then the last thing is this really cute pouch. So I saw uh, Linda Loves Creating. I saw her share about this bag that she uses. Let's go ahead and open it. This is called... Um, it's a Vercord canvas handbag organizer. I believe this is the small and they do have a like a larger one and it does come in several different sizes. So this one is like like a really nice white um, what would I say it's called like sand maybe. And then it has a really pretty uh, brown lining and it has several pockets in here that you can just organize. So this is made for purse organization, but, but it's really nice for um, crafting supplies as well. And you can just um, even, I think you can close it up, can you? Yeah, you can make it a little bit tighter and it kind of stands up by itself which is really nice so you can put it on your desk i wanted to try so i have this archer and olive notebook i think this is a b an a5 so this is an a5 and <coughs> this a5 does fit in the um in this small pouch so you could take this on the go i've been doing some on the go crafting and so it's kind of neat to be able to like so you can put some markers and uh, some stickers in here and it fits um really nice let me see this other one this is also almost like an a5 this is my bible journal and it fits in here as well. So it does come with um, other colors, but I chose this like neutral color and um, I really, really like it. I think it's really cool. And one, one of the things that I really liked was that you can uh, put little pins on it. So let me get, <clears throat> this is my pin collection. Let's move this out of the way here. So I thought I would put some really fun little pins on here. This is just my flag of my like planning pins. I also have one just for travel. Uh, I really like 
this girl because this is a wrong wrong girl that I got through the happy planner and so you just put it through hopefully I won't lose them while I'm on the go but I thought they would be really cool and then let me see happy planner I guess I'll put this happy planner one on here just to give this guy some decor so that when I'm out and about um, I can take it with me and it can look really pretty this one has actually double Let's see. Here we go. This is so. This one I believe is from Archer and Olive. Was it Archer and Olive? I think so. I think these were from Archer and Olive. This is a Happy Planner. This is Happy Planner as well. So I think I'll leave it at three, and then um, I will take it with me and try it out and see if I like it. And then I can just keep on adding different little uh, pins to it as I travel and just uh, find some more goodies. So if you're looking for a nice organizer for your bag or for your crafty uh, items, I think this is a really, really good option. All right, so the next thing I wanna show you are these, um, what are they called? They're like, pouches or slots pencil pencil pouches so these I got from Amazon and they have a slot for each pencil I mean you can use this for pens as well and they are made out of cloth very sturdy and then you just kind of roll it and you can tie it so I got this one that was the ballerinas and then this one is the puny, puny flowers. So this one is for 36. This one is for 24, 24 pencils. This one's for 36. So I have different sizes or I have different collections of pencils. And see how pretty this one is. Here's the inside. So your pencil, there's a lot of um, thread. So let's test it out here. So you put in your pencil and then your pencil can rest down here at the bottom. So my idea is since I color on the go, mostly like on the couch or, you know, if I'm on, on my bed, um, I like to be able to see all the colors um, and spread them out. So I just thought being able to have them in a pouch would be nice because that way I don't have to organize them every single time I use them. I can just go ahead and open the pouch. And so this one, this one is a 24 slot pack and it is a Paris Tower. I will leave the um, the links to all these goodies in case you're interested down at the bottom. And this one I thought was really pretty. Just if you're like a really like pink and girly things, this one was really nice. So I am going to organize my things here. Um, I have different sets as you can see. I have some stuff just here in my box. Uh, this is like a, a, like a little drawer. And then every time that I would come and be ready to color, I would have to pull all this out. And it was just, it actually stopped me from actually, you know, using my supplies because um, they're not organized so I am going to see how I'll organize and show you and then I'll come right back
okay so the first one is done there is space here for like a pencil sharpener or uh let's see the pencil sharpener or also an eraser you can also put that in here and then you just kind of roll it or fold it i think rolling it is probably the easiest and then you just close it so just like this and now when i am ready to color my colors are in rainbow order or from light to dark is what i usually like to put them in and they always will be organized and i can take them on the go and they're all ready for me to use them so i thought this was really really nice i'm gonna do the rest and then come right back to show you how those turned out as well. Okay, that takes care of the twistables that I have. I love the way they look so, so beautiful. And I love the black. Um, it just brings out the colors in this set. And I still do have a little bit more room because this is a like a 36 pack. I wonder if we can roll it. Can we? Since there's nothing here on the edge, let's see if we can roll it. Yes, we can. Okay. So, of course, this um, is brand new, so there's still a little bit hard to, you know, manipulate, but it looks really pretty and it just stores all my beautiful pencils. So let's do one more. Okay, that is my Colors of the World pencils. I really love these neutral color sets. And these are also Crayola. I love, sometimes I do like to color in a monochromatic color palette. And this is, these are a wonderful set to do that with. And I did pick on purpose just different covers so that if I'm just grabbing I know exactly which one which set has which cover and um, with that I am done organizing with these really cute organizers all right friends I hope you enjoyed these um, different tools that I showed you today if you want any of these I have the link down below and I hope it just inspires you to organize your things in a more efficient way. I know sometimes we kind of set up uh, different systems for the just for, for right now and then we never get back to organizing that and I think when we organize our things uh, we use them and I think for me especially with these uh, pencils I really want to get back into coloring more and I know that having them just uh, ready to go and so portable will help me to increase um, that uh, creativity area in my life and then when I go crafting on the go I think this little uh, 
organizer is going to be just so cool to be able to take with me and if you do a lot of uh, crafting and you use a lot of um you know glue uh this these guys this uh, double-sided adhesive is just wonderful all right friends as always if you enjoyed the video please leave me a like and if you have any questions or comments over what i shared you can always leave it down below all right friends i'll see you in the next one Bye bye